The number three. The facts. The fiction. And fantasy. I'm Vaughn Roberts, and welcome to the fascinating world of the number three. Three has played a major role in art, culture, and spiritualism for thousands of years. It has inspired books, such as Charles Dickens' classic, A Christmas Carol. Hit movies like The Three Amigos and The Three Musketeers. And forms bases of many religious beliefs and stories to this very day. And action! Where's that wise man with the short staff from again? In no clue. But he brought all the gifts. Ho, ho, ho. Got Prezi for Baby Jeezy. It's Baby Jesus. And quiet. He sleep, a fat man. I'm Angel. Jesus mother, virgin. Not prostitute. Situation comedies, better known as sitcoms, have consistently been one of the most successful television genres since the 1970s. Hugely popular sitcoms such as Friends, under the Big Bang Theory, have raked in millions and keep eyeballs glued to the small screen. But what exactly makes it so appealing? My answer, the number three. Yes, three. It's the bedrock structure of the humor which gets you laughing out loud over and over again. Every joke consists of three parts, the setup or situation, the punchline, and tag. Ha ha ha. They are so funny. Remember the 80s sitcom, Three's Company? Yes, it was hilarious. But it also highlighted the fundamental benefits of having great friendships. Good company is really all about three. Firstly, it's a safe haven for all your deepest darkest secrets. I know what you did last summer, but I'll still protect you by not telling the police, unless. Secondly, it's a tailor-made environment that caters to beneficial emotional support, she cheated, you broke a nail, you fell on your face at the mall. I'm here for you even though you totaled my car. And third. It's a place of mutual acceptance and respect, despite knowing that you enjoy being spanked with an old 80s model TV aerial. Sick bastard. Having fun in the sun is great. If you with your soulmate. LOL. I'm a poet, I didn't know it. Watch out. There's a very very big. Very big what? Shark. Ha ha. Let the silly loser go. Stupid freaking third wheel. All around the world, in every culture, three is considered to be a very lucky number. To Cantonese-speaking Chinese it's a great number. Three is used when we perform an action in synchrony. Now, on the count of three, everybody click the like button. LOL. Third time's the charm, after two failures, a third attempt at you clicking the like button, is bound to succeed. Remember now, luck, comes in threes. Don't freaking let go! Let go of the dice my love. Lucky trois. Oui, oui. Dr. Sigmund Freud, you are considered the father of psychology, and have the rise that the human psyche has three distinct parts. That is correct. Erst hat sehr die primitive, unconscious part of the mindestens contains aggressive instincts. Zweit hat sehr super ego, our subconscious moral center. Dritt hat sehr ego, who you are. The mediator of the angel und debil in sight. I knew it. I knew you were cheating with. Your. Your best friend? Cheating is cheating. And on your first day. 
and then both. Gelongen. Make em do it again. Then señor, the board's get us. Dude. Don't. It's your surprise birthday gift. Ever wondered where the saying, bad luck comes in threes, originated from? Soldiers in the trenches of the First World War believed it was unlucky to take a third light, that is, to be the third person to light a cigarette from the same match or lighter, as an enemy sniper might see the first light, take aim on the second, and fire on the third. Are you bloody bonkers? Never. Give a bloke. A third. Light. Sorry mate didn't know that. Is it bad luck then? Eins, zwei, drei, im Kopf. All great speeches have this in common, a structure consisting of three interlinking parts. A beginning. A middle. An end. My amazing life story. Where do I start? When do you stop? Three is the cycle of life. We are born, we grow up, then we die. We see our world in trichromatic color and three dimensions. Every living organism on Earth can be categorized into one of three domains of life, eukaryotes, prokaryotes, and archaea. We, humans, are eukaryotic entities, basically a bunch of cells composed of a nucleus enclosed in a nuclear envelope all clumped together. Three beats two at the Olympics. The silver medalist replays, I coulda woulda shoulda won gold, four years. To the third placed athlete, winning the bronze is equivalent to gold. I got a medal. Shoo, almost didn't make the podium. Glad I'm not four. What did he get? A participation certificate? Three dominates global sports. Terms to describe three such as three strikes, three points, trebles, three peats, hat tricks, are littered across the planet and can be found in every major sport on earth. Every game played, from American football, association football, rugby league, rugby union, baseball, basketball, bowling, ice hockey, cricket, even triathlons and professional wrestling all rely on that handy little scorekeeping number. Three. Three played a significant role in the ancient world. To the ancient Greeks, the numbers 1 to 9 held sacred meanings. 1, unity. Plus 2, disorder, equals 3, harmony. Feudal Japan's noble class had three levels, the emperor, the daimyo warlords, and the samurai. To the Romans, the numeral 3 stood for giant star. In Greek civilization, three is divine communication. Giant star. Versus. Rising sun. In Japan, three is plus, courage, compassion. I kill three warriors at the games. Three lines denoted the number three in many cultures. India's 4th to 6th century, Gupta Empire, modified it by adding a curve on each line. Where's he going into the desert with a baby elephant and a tree? Probably sell it. He sells everything. The Islamic Caliphate later adopted the Gupta curve, but rotated the lines from vertical to horizontal, creating the modern Arabic numeral we use today. Gupta, 300 years to bring Thalaf, what the alamat was to him. You say 15 minutes, boss, and your baby elephant now, tough for my three. 
इट्स नॉट बेबी एलिफेंट इट्स पथित इंडियन नॉट जायट अफ्रीकन बुरा टुक टन मिनट्स बट यू गॉट नो रोड नो साइन नो फोन सिग्नल जस्ट ब्लडी सैंड कवरी बेयर वन टू थ्री फाउ फाइव सिक्स सेफ इन एट नाइन टा अब्दुल वेट फुल रन यू आर इ फ्रॉम कुब टू आई एम बेयर स्टेट कैप्चर वी टेक थ्री इट वर्क्स फॉर लॉन्ग टर्म इन्वेस्टमेंट इन फेज इन दियर्स आवर चिल्ड्रन रिच फ्रॉम ब्लैक कौल किथ हिम वाहिद इराइबीन स्टेली Three is the smallest odd prime number, but there is nothing small or odd about its impact on human civilization. The triangle is the most stable shape. Ancient Egyptian mathematics date back to as early as 3000 BC. Their astounding ability to accurately compute complex geometrical problems, including the area of a triangle, resulted in the magnificent creation and only remaining wonder of the ancient world. The pyramids of Giza. While Pythagoras's triangle puts geometry students to sleep, the three-sided musical instrument is a hit in elementary school. Popularized by Turkish Janissaries, today it's an orchestral instrument. My piano is a stable. I'm a what? A horse. Foot shape. Laugh and a cat. About a third of the entire cosmos is made up of matter, the stuff you see and touch every day. Matter is made up of atoms, which are made up of three subatomic particles: protons, neutrons, and electrons. There are three states of matter: solid, the cup in your hand; liquid, the coffee in the cup; and gas, the steam evaporating from your hot cup giving off an aroma. Pepsi, pardon me. Really cat. Gas again. Solid und liquid in Tag at lunch matters. Orika, the three states of matter. Solid. Liquid. Gas. <lacht> <lacht> 